I will discuss about the concept called null point. So null point is nothing but the point where the net gravitational field is equal to zero. So we can say that null point is the point at which resultant gravitational field and density is zero. That means if you are uh, just considering that there is an object of mass uh, let's say m1 and another object of mass uh, let's say m2 and these two masses were separated by a distance uh, take it as something like r suppose our aim is to find out where this net gravitational field is equal to zero so we can observe that uh, in between mass m1 and m2 in between this mass m1 and m2 assume that at a point p which is at a distance x from m1 or at a distance r minus x from m2 there is a point p where the net gravitational field is zero that means let's say at point p gravitational field due to m1 is taken as g1 vector and which is acting towards left and because of m2 there is a gravitational field take it as g2 vector which is acting towards left if their magnitude is same then we can say that net gravitational field at point p will be equal to zero so we can say that uh, this g m1 divided by x square should be equal to g m2 divided by r minus x the whole square so if you are uh, just taking root on both the sides so we can say that root of m1 divided by x will be equal to under root of m2 divided by r minus x so we can take it as uh, root of m1 into r minus x is equal to root of m2 into x so from this we can find out what about the value of this uh, x over here so root of m1 r minus uh, root of m1 x is equal to uh, root of m2 into x so we can write root of m1 into r is equal to root of m1 plus root of m2 into x so we can write the equation for this x is equal to nothing but uh, r into under root of m1 divided by uh, root of m1 plus uh, root of m2 or you can write this x is equal to r divided by if you're dividing this one by m1 we'll get as it is uh, 1 plus a root of m2 divided by root of m1 so for the calculation we can use this equation x is equal to r divided by under root of m2 by m1 plus 1 so this will be the distance from m1 where the value of net gravitational field is equal to 0